Hello Leo, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. We have honest, honesty and communication. So this is about being up front here. Somebody could be honest and being up front with you. Five of Earth, and this is equivalent to the Five of Pentacles in the traditional tarot deck. The Five of Pentacles. Fear surrounding money, the wisdom to accept help from others, uncertain self-employment. Now this can be feeling as if your cup's half empty instead of half full here. So let's see what the guidance is. If this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. It might be here if there's disappointments, feeling left out in the cold, that you need to be honest and you need to speak up here. There could be help available if you need it. There could be support. But it's very uncertain times here. The King of Wands. The Four of Cups. The Knight of Cups. The Devil Energy, which is Capricorn Energy. The overall central energy is the King of Cups. Two of Cups, the Knight of Pentacles, the High Priestess, and the Eight of Pentacles. Now, there is devil energy here, which can be self-doubt. It can be self-doubt. This can be toxic environments and situations and relationships, habits that we've got into that aren't serving us well. It could be to do with finances as well, like it's saying here, but it could be any area of your life we're talking about because there's pentacles on this table. We've got the eight of pentacles, which means due to work and career as well. So what we're needing to do is anything that we're feeling hemmed in with, uh, any kind of fear we have, it could be a situation, a personal environment that we feel chained to here. We need to be looking at this situation and we need to be honest about it. And we need to be listening to our intuition. What we're seeing, sensing and feeling around you is definitely important here. So time to be honest or be honest with other people. Possibly speaking up here um, listening to your intuition understanding here that you don't have to be chained to anything. You're meant to be passionate about life. You're meant to be enjoying life. Now, you've always got skills and talents you could be using to go forward. Now, it, you know, it doesn't mean you can sing and dance, you know, and you're, you're ready to write a book and you become famous. This is really just recognising your abilities, your strengths in life. Um, you could be, for example, starting up your own business. You could be learning a new hobby. You could be developing a hobby that you already have. And it could free you from your job. Uh, you could have a sideline here that could eventually be very productive for you in the future. So learning new skills, studying, starting up your own business, all this type of thing. You have got the ability here and we have to recognise that to be able to go forward towards happier times here. Now, you can't be doubting yourself. You can't be doubting your ability to start up something new here because it's saying uncertain self-employment. If you work to your skill set and you trust and believe in something and you work at it, you will have the ability to take, you know, to do whatever your heart desires here, whatever you're passionate about. And this is about having the confidence to do it, because if you work to your skill set and you trust and believe in yourself, anything can happen. You will start to move forward and it can be baby steps. Now, there's opportunities here. You might not enamored, you're bored and fed up with life here. You're looking at things and it's not in, my, in my, you know, you're not impressed by what you're looking at so it's time here to look at things that are holding you back that you feel chained to take these baby steps to go forward this can be gathering information it can be doing some research it could be doing a course like i say it could be a new opportunity that comes forward to you through researching things so this could be a virgo taurus or capricorn energy that brings you a new opportunity that you could work on that you're passionate about so it's time to look at the bigger picture here it's time to listen to your intuition you're very good at what you do on a daily basis. You've got the skills here and the ability. You might want to bring in a mentor and go towards promotion and become a boss type figure. Because whatever you're doing, you're focusing on it. You're working to your skill set and through time, you're going to improve your situation tenfold. So you're building security for yourself. Focus on what's important for you and don't doubt your ability here. To be able to bring the changes in or follow your heart's desire or follow your dreams or whatever you're passionate about here, it's time to look at it and focus on it. And don't be distracted by everything else here. Like I say, if there's new contracts, if you're going towards new employment or taking up new jobs and moving your skills, if there's anything you're signing here, look at the small print. You know, look at the details of things because it's the baby steps and taking your time that's going to serve you the best. 
So don't be jumping into things. Take your time, research it. Like I say, look into everything. And you will find something here that you're really passionate about. And when you follow your heart's desire here, and it's about going towards your happiness, um, you're going to focus and work on it. You're going to create great security for your future. So that skill that you're learning, that new thing that you're starting up, you know, is going to, if you work on it, you're going to create security. It could bring financial benefits as well. If it's new courses that you're working on, you could end up with better paid jobs. It's that type of energy. Don't be frightened here to go forward. Don't be frightened here to look at things and um, in a different way as well. I think some of you need to do a wee bit of research here as well and look at some, it'll help you look at things from a different perspective and you'll move forward towards happier times. The right people will show up. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy will show up to help you. And it's about your future now. It's about what do you want your future to be? And it's about you finding that emotional balance between what you're doing now. It's not making you happy. It's about finding that emotional balance and being passionate about what you're investing your time and energies into. And like I say, this can be anything. You could be going, leaving toxic relationships and bosses and going towards new partnerships, uh, better people, more genuine people that come forward here. Um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio energy. But you're finding that balance within your friendships, your relationships, your private life, um, your any kind of relationship and you're finding that contentment for yourself here we've got two animals 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 are important to you animals heal comfort and relax you and it might be you have pets it might be you need to take a walk in nature and ground yourself to get the clarity you need clearing clearing remove energy blockages by clearing out unwanted emotional and material clutter time to get rid of everything that you feel chained to there's a brand new beginning could start for you. Be honest about it and speak up. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.